Welcome to a special live service all the way from Atlanta, Georgia. Thank you so much for joining us. Right now, these are your announcements. It's a regular week here at Philadelphia with Monday through Friday noonday prayer. Stop in for your lunch break. Tuesday Bible study will be at 7 p.m. Join us. And if you missed last week's Bible study, go to pccsermons.com to get it. Thursday School of Prayer is at 6.15, and the Fire Ministry, the Free Indeed Recovery Experience meets every Thursday night at 7 p.m. So if the sun sets you free, you will be free indeed. The Nursing Home Ministry is today at 1.45 p.m. at River Oaks Nursing Home, bringing the gospel of Jesus Christ to those who are in nursing home facilities. The Atlanta School of the Hebrews Conference 2018 has been a great experience. Many from all parts of the country have come to be a part of this great awakening. First of all, I wanted to, uh, I'm, I'm happy to meet James Malvo because I hear Pastor Tebow always talk about James Malvo on the YouTube videos, and so I came over to meet him. But the way in which I got to Pastor Tebow was my own thirst for knowing who we are, what was going on with our people, and the fact that um, I see what was happening with the children in Israel in the book, in, in the in the Pentateuch, in the book of, of Exodus and have you, and it seemed like that was aligned to what was happening with our people here in this day and age. And so my heart and my search for about three years really led me to Pastor Steve Darby and a, a colleague of mine said, well, if you listen to Pastor Darby, you need to check out Pastor Tebow, and that's how I got here. It's only been since last December, right? Two weeks after Pastor Darby passed away, and so uh, this has been such a blessing uh, to me, such a blessing to me, and I'm here to learn everything, to soak up everything, and just to listen so that I can take this back into my community, and as I said, uh, on the school board, I serve as commissioner. Uh, we have one of the lowest graduation rates in our community, in the state. And here's a time, as Pastor Tebow talked about today, that what Daniel did, he began to pray for his people. And that's what I plan to do in Rochester, for the city of Rochester and for the Rochester Board of Education. And so I'm so thrilled and excited and looking forward to see what God is going to do on behalf of his people. Thank you. I'm Tara Pauly. And I'm Rodney Pauly. We're from Dallas, Texas. And, uh... Um, Wow, this, is, this has been awesome because I came to the conference last year and my wife wasn't able to come and, and you know, you go and you're trying to share this information when you get back home and do all this kind of stuff and, you know, she's uh, been on her own journey, you know, and, and I've given her the, uh, the latitude to do that in regards to just, you know, finding out for herself and for her to come here. I'm and, just overwhelmed. I literally just want to go fall out of the They've been awesome. All the speakers have been amazing. The, you know, the um, the artists, the praise dancers, everybody has just been so amazing. It's just been a an awesome opportunity to see the excellence of God at work when He's starting to move us and propel us into this new dimension as far as the kingdom. So we're just ex elated and ecstatic, and we're just looking forward to the next time. Hopefully, y'all be to Dallas soon. Come to Dallas. Amen. I'm DeMarcus Shaw from Virginia Beach, Virginia, part of the School of Hebrews chapter of Virginia. And I came down here to the Atlanta Conference to be a part of the awakening of my people, of the people, because we are the people. I love Pastor Omar. I love Philadelphia. You guys are doing an awesome job. And just believe that you are changing lives. You changed my life. You changed my family's life. And it's only getting better from here. I'm Justin Gary from Charleston, South Carolina. I came down here on a whim. I really wasn't even planning on coming down here. I was like, I ain't doing nothing. I'm going to come on down. I got the word, learned some things. Um, a whole lot of stuff I was not taught. I was just like everybody else, basically getting what was taught through, you know, 
Kazars or whatever. And it's, it's eye opening. Everybody needs to see this. We need to see this on a on a global level. I, I even have ideas to put it out on a global level so we can make this prophecy speed up. So here I am, School of the Hebrews. Anytime the man is in the town or in your area, go on out, check it out. If you don't talk for too long, it's, it's, it's not going to be like three or four hours or anything like that. It's a quick sermon, about an hour, maybe an hour and a half. You get the word, you go home, you spread the word. Each one teach two. Justin Gary, Maggie. I'm Sir Caleb Williams. I'm from Albion, Michigan. This is my sister. Yeah, I'm Taylor. I'm from Albion, <laughs> uh, We heard of Pastor Omar online, and we just fell in love with the spirit that he had brought forth. Um, we just love everything about Philadelphia and what they're bringing out for the Hebrews, for our people, just lifting us up. It's been an awesome conference this year. It's been great. We can't wait for the next one. We can't wait to start our own chapter. That's what we're here for, to just learn more and bring more people into this knowledge that we have. And we just love it. It's been awesome. And it's so awesome. Don't ever take for granted the things that God is showing you in yeah. the process that He is showing it to you. Songwriter producer, originally from Buffalo, New York, um, care of the uh, well from the DC chapter, care of Florida. I just moved there. Um, I am part of the school of Hebrews, and I just love the Philadelphia Church. Uh, Pastor, Pastor um, Tebow and the and the, fam, the church family here. Um, the worship was excellent. PMG, everybody, which is awesome. Um, and I just love to worship um, with you all and just learning so much about who we are as a people. It's just so motivating and so wonderful. So I just want to say hi and to just give a shout out to all of you out there. Um, my website, if you want to hear some of my music and other information, is uh, www.christinaatleast.com or uh, facebook.com slash Music or facebook.com slash Ministries. And the same for YouTube. So definitely check me out and let's, uh, let's continue to worship the Lord together and to stay woke because we the people. Yes. Israel Brown, out of Atlanta, Georgia. Um, we love it. It's been great, man. It's been awesome. We've enjoyed every minute of it. I'm um, the vice president of the Atlanta chapter. I'm going to pass it to the president of the Atlanta chapter. Hey, what's going on? I'm going to invite you back home there in Louisiana, because that's home. Philadelphia, what's going on with y'all? This is Stephen Govan, president of the Atlanta chapter. This conference has been off the chain. PMG Music Group did their thing. Hey, if you don't know who PMG is, you need to find out. Listen to everything Pastor Omar is telling us. My people, we need to wake up because we are the people. Shalom. And today you get to be a part of day three of the conference with a live viewing right from the conference room here in Atlanta, Georgia. So let's go right into the conference live.